Well, hello there, my sweet hypno lovelies. It feels like I haven't conversed with you in a while. So it's good to be back. It's Tansy here from Tansy Forest Hypnotherapy, speaking with you from my practice in South London. And the recording I've written for you today is a deep sleep hypnosis to calm your mind and fall asleep fast. And it was inspired by the most beautiful walk I had yesterday. And I will be taking you with me to a country estate for rest and relaxation. And the narrative is also a reflection of the passing nature of the seasons. We will begin with some mindfulness techniques, a full body relaxation, and then take a visit to the country house and parklands, finally ending up at the most calm and tranquil place to rest for the night. I hope you will feel as revitalised as I did after this experience when you awaken in the morning. And I'd like to say a big thank you to all my lovely subscribers around the world. You know who you are. Those in Canada, America, Australia, and also in Europe. Do we have anyone listening in from France or Germany, perhaps? I'm always interested to find out where you're listening in from, in different parts of the world. So please comment and let me know below. And a huge shout out to all my Patreons. You really are an amazing support in the creation of fresh new material for everyone to enjoy. Sending big hugs to you all. And on that note, if you'd like to join my Patreon community where you can have access to lots of other perks such as ad-free listening and much more, Please see the link below for more details and thank you in advance for considering this. So for now, this is your time. And I would like you Get really cosy in your soft, comfortable bed. Remembering how good it feels to climb under the covers. and pull them gently over you. Spend a few moments just stretching out the muscles in your body. That's good. Finding the most comfortable position for you. Then you might like to take some deep breaths in through the nose and out through the mouth. In through the nose and out through the mouth. And when you're breathing out, perhaps you might like to do this in a lovely long sigh.
and you can feel your body starting to settle. Settle into the comfort of the surface beneath you. Supporting you. Holding you. Comforting you. The weight of your body sinking down deeper into the comforting ease of your mattress. Feels so good to be here right now. The time you've set aside for rest. For the day is done. And I know that you've given your best. And everything else is worthy of forgiveness. As you take this gentle transition from doing into being, from active to passive. Unrestful journey. We all need to allow our body to rest and to heal. And it's such a wonderful time that you can look forward to every single night. You may have a beautiful ritual, perhaps some flowers by your bed, or a lovely plant, maybe some aromatherapy oils. Some carefully placed droplets. Away from contact with your skin. But yet near enough so that you can smell the relaxing oil. Perhaps lavender, patchouli, or geranium. These are some of the oils that I use in my nightly routine. I find it helps me ease into a sleepy state. A 
calm and happy state. Such a delightful moment of self-care at the end of a busy day. Where the process of unwinding can begin. And I don't know whether it will take you a little time or perhaps a longer time to relax. But it doesn't matter either way because the process has begun. You are listening to my words now and the gentle, pleasant sensations that they give you. Allowing my words to wash and flow over your body and your mind. Gently. Calmly, as you prepare for a beautiful night's rest. And you may feel your covers gently touching your skin in places. You may notice the temperature of the air in the room. On your skin. Is it warm or cool? You may observe that your breathing has slowed down now. Just gently tuning in to the sensation of your chest. Rising and falling. Your chest rising as you breathe in. And falling as you breathe out. The air from your lungs gently flows out to the space that surrounds you. It's a beautiful natural rhythm that happens all on its own. No need to control your breathing. Just observing. Just allowing. And it's wonderful to know that simply by tuning in to these experiences, your mind naturally moves away from overanalyzing. or the overactivity of the thinking mind. It 
into the present moment. present time, the present place, you may hear sounds around you, in the room perhaps, or further in the distance out in the street, a passing car, or an aeroplane overhead on its journey to a distant land. These sounds won't bother you at all. In fact, it can be comforting to know that life goes on. And you can just continue searching for sounds now. And it's funny how such a small thing can be really rather pleasant. Searching for sounds. Tuning into your breathing. Just allowing. Just observing. No need to change the breathing. Just observing. Gently. Calmly. Tuning in with the inner life of your body. And it may be that you have a sense of your limbs becoming heavier now. As your body relaxes there in the bed. Easily, calmly, nobody wanting anything, nobody needing anything. This is your time now. The time you've set aside to rest. Release the day and simply drift with my words. We all have so many roles in life. Perhaps to be a good family member, to be a mother or a father, a friend, a relative, work colleague.
or employee. We all have these multiple roles in life. And sometimes managing all these responsibilities, trying to keep everyone happy, trying to keep everything in balance, is difficult to do. And the mind does its best to manage all of these things. But everyone has their limits. And we are only human. Sometimes when we're stressed or overwhelmed by the stuff of life. It may lead to a sense of physical or mental unease. For some people, it may manifest in feeling anxious, stressed, or for others, experience sleep disturbances. These are common things that many people face. You are not alone. And I am here as your guide. as I speak with you and help you let go of the stresses and strains of life. And a wise person once told me But all we can do is our best. Make decisions with the information that we have to hand at the time. We can learn. We can grow. But it's very normal to make mistakes or errors of judgment. And this happens to us all from time to time. But we can learn and we can grow and we can accept ourselves. Because it is what it is to be human. And in life, perfection is rarely needed. Just resting here. I know that you've given your best. And tomorrow will look after itself. taking in the comfort of my words, as tomorrow will take care of itself. This is your time, a time for rest and renewal, and you will awaken refresh tomorrow. 
as it is a new day. A new opportunity for us all. So just for now, you can give yourself permission to let go, let go and feel your body as it sinks down into the mattress. Your gentle awareness travels to your forehead and as it does, all the muscles in the forehead smooth out, as smooth as a piece of silk. Even your eyebrows relax. And then all the muscles, the tiny muscles around the eyes, release and let go. And then down into the jaw. And many of us hold tension in our jaw. And you can just let go now. And even allow a little space between the teeth as the tongue relaxes. Your lips as the top lip touches the bottom lip. You can release any facial expressions at all. As your awareness moves down to the neck area. Smoothing out the muscles and tendons in the neck. The shoulders sinking down, down and down. Any tensions or residual discord in the shoulders is released. Now relax and release, down the right arm, now the elbow, the right wrist, the top of your hand, the bottom of your hand, the palm of your hand. each finger, you might even like to flex your fingers and hands now, because many of us that do typing can hold tensions in the hands, it's nice just to stretch them out. feeling loose, peaceful and heavy. And now your gentle awareness travels down to the left shoulder, the left upper arm, the left elbow, as the soothing balm of your attention moves down and down and down. Softly washing over your wrist and your hand, top of your hand, all fingers are relaxed and heavy, both right and left arm feeling so heavy. 
You may even feel a slight tingling in the fingers. That's quite alright. Simply means you're relaxing even more. Such soothing feelings pass into your chest now. The abdomen. Your tummy. Becomes calm and quiet. Resting. All the organs now, so peaceful, as the gentle balm passes down into your pelvic area, soothing, healing. And then down into your right side. Smoothly down into your right thigh. Easing out the muscles and tendons in the right side. Smoothing down into the knee. Any residual tensions flowing away from you now. Right calf. Releases, relaxes beautifully. Down into the ankle. Down into the foot. Your lovely feet have been carrying you all day now. And it's their time to relax. Quietly, calmly, down and down. Your whole right leg is peaceful and heavy. And now in your mind, your awareness travels into your left leg. Now your left side down and down into the knee. A place that we can all hold tiredness. This is now released. Down and down into the calf. Smoothing out the kinks from the day. You might even like to stretch the legs a little now. Wiggle your toes and feel that tension. As you tense your muscles and then release. And they feel even more delightfully relaxed afterwards. As the flow of your awareness passes down and down into the left ankle. Now bathed in a tranquil peacefulness, moving down to the bottom of the foot, top of the foot, the toes, the big toes, sensing both of your big toes now. From the top of your head, down your whole body, you're feeling calm and peaceful. You're safe here with me, as the body is begin to relax, and so the mind can gently be in an easier state. This 
state of slowing down, all the day's events. As they become of less and less interest to you now. It almost seems as if they're drifting away from you now. Drifting away from you as you move smoothly into a state of deep peace. You may even feel a sense of broadening and deepening. As you're tapping into these resources that I know you have. Calmly. Tranquilly. And I don't know if it'll take you a little time or a longer time to drift off to sleep. But it doesn't matter. Because the wonderful news is the sleep will come to you the perfect time. Welcoming you into its arms. As you give yourself over to the sweet serenity of rest. Deep, deep rest. And since you're feeling a little more peaceful now, I would like you to come with me to a beautiful place, deep in your imagination. And it is my honour to be your guide. As I lead you to this natural and beautiful retreat that is so renewing, so peaceful, and yet so grounding. And as you look ahead, you are walking on a path. The path is lined with horse chestnut trees. These strong and proud, yet ancient trees so tall. They look as though they could have been here for at least a hundred to two hundred, maybe almost three hundred years. The bark is pale brown, in places dappled lighter, and yet darker in others. with a slight pinky hue. It has an almost layered texture to the bark. But what is most striking about these giant trees are the huge pendulous branches with curled up tips.
the abundant bright green leaves are distinctive and are composed of five to seven leaflets. They splay out, creating one large combined leaf. That looks like a fan in a distinctive horseshoe shape. And the branches and leaves of these trees are densely covering your walkway from a grand height. And amongst the leaves and branches, you can see the green spiky round capsules containing the deep chestnut brown conker. Some lie on the ground split open to reveal the glossy fruit. A harbinger of autumn, a small sign of a later season. And a promise of the golden, red and brown leaves to come. But for now, the leaves are a beautiful green. They blow gently in the wind. As you continue gently along the pale and dusty path, feeling so calm and peaceful, each step you take moves you down into a restful state. As you walk along the path and take in the views, birds flying here and there, calling to each other, you notice that there are so many varieties of birds living side by side. branch by branch. As you walk you find yourself noticing the succession of trees. And as every tree you pass you feel more deeply relaxed. I will count them off for you from ten to one, counting the trees, and the further you go along the path, the more restful you will feel. Ten, down and down, deeper down, nine. Moving gently under the leaf canopy. Eight. Drifting. Drifting. On this lovely late summer's day. Seven. Feeling more relaxed. And peaceful. Six. Letting go of any worries or concerns. 
five, moving ever deeper down, four, three, down to that deeper, healthier level of the mind, two, one, letting go completely now. The more you let go, the better you feel. Drifting along that beautiful path. The sunshine penetrating through the leaves as the canopy becomes more sparse. You can feel the warming sensation on your skin, gently relaxing you. A little way ahead, you can see a peaceful, quiet field. The long grasses swaying in the summer breeze. There's no one around. But you feel happy and calm, drifting towards the gold green field. It all looks so inviting as you move forward. And you decide to rest for a while in the field. At an inviting looking spot. By an old oak tree. grass is slightly shorter there, but it's still tall enough to surround you in a cocoon of deep peace. There is a beautiful patchwork blanket laid out on the ground, and a pillow so comfortable for you to rest your head. The soft grass under the blanket makes it so cushioned and you delight in resting for a while here as it feels so comfortable and warm. You can hear the wind in the trees the soft bird song, all the gentle sounds of nature as you rest your head on such a comfortable pillow and sink into the space underneath you, listening to the sounds of nature, such a wonderful meditation in itself. You have no need for anything, as you feel at one with yourself. The flora and fauna, and the universe, just resting, drifting, and dreaming. It's as if everything in nature is here for you, to soothe you, to calm you, to send you the message that it's good to be alive, it's good to be alive and looking after you and resting in this beautiful place. Nothing bothers you at all. Nothing bothers you and you could lie here forever, taking in the views, trees overhead, branches swaying in the wind, such a lovely time of year, but the yellow and orange will come, 
the change of season, the promise of the bounty of autumn. So lovely to think of the changing seasons, a wonderful natural cycle happens all on its own, moving gently from one to the other season in such a unique manner. You decide to explore more of the beautiful country estate as you begin to walk again. Ahead of you, you hear the sound of water, so refreshing and cleansing. So inviting to look and walk by the river and cooler too as you are protected from the late summer sun as you approach the riverside path that leads along this streaming body of water and you can see that there are many lovely plants and flowers. The flora and fauna adorn the riverbanks and the water flows gently and peacefully. There are big fish in the river, perhaps trout or salmon. Their gentle movement so relaxing to watch. Big fish small fish moving through the water smoothly quietly peacefully flowing flowing down and down as you walk on the path towards the rose garden, far ahead, rambling gently ever onwards. You are enjoying looking at the broad variety of plants. something that looks like a huge green rhubarb leaf with spikes drapes into the water and ducks move peacefully on the water's surface the little ducklings following them with their new and soft feathers such beauty, such grace in the natural world. As you move on down towards the house, you are approaching the rose garden and you can smell the sweet scent of the roses calling you forth. As you approach, you can see the manicured beds of different shapes and sizes of all the varieties of roses in pink, yellow, white and red. Absolutely divine. As you bend your head and take in the scent. Around
around each rose bed is a soft lawn and you can feel this underneath your feet as you move gently ever onwards into that deep feeling of peace and tranquility. Towards the mansion house in the distance, beyond the rose garden, is a huge bay tree. Long arms of the tree are covered in the dark green leaves. It's huge. And the branches have splayed out to create a little area in the centre by the trunk. A little hidey hole that children would love to spend time in. Playing among the branches. There's no one around now. But you pause to behold the beauty of the bay tree. Tall and proud with dark branches protruding from many different angles. Such a wonderful tree to build a tree house. Perhaps a reminder of pleasant childhood memories. You walk on past the tree and over a beautiful humpback white bridge. Wrought iron but painted white. Some of the paint is peeling off in places and the stream flows beautifully underneath. Water moving on its way. The water is deeper today, moving a little faster. You can see the leaves under the water's surface, moving up and then down. I like the rising of emotions, up to the surface not quite breaking the surface and then down again, disappearing, reminds you of the flow of our emotional state, the fluidity of our feelings, this will all come to pass. You are feeling so tired now, on the main lawn of the large white Georgian house. You are feeling safe, tranquil, happy and secure, yet very sleepy. You can see the large door calling you forward. And as you enter the house, you are enveloped in its majesty. The walls are lined with beautiful art paintings. And there is a lovely wooden staircase leading up to your bedroom. As you place your foot on the first stair, You feel a deep sense of calm. A feeling of being totally safe. Protected. And happy. Your mind is at peace and your body is relaxed. 
taking each step in time. Padding up the soft carpeted stairs. And stepping into your room, you close the door. It's a lovely room. And you have a huge, comfortable, clean, fresh bed with lovely pillows just the way you like them. There is a window overlooking the lawn, the river, and the parklands beyond. You can see the tops of the horse chestnut trees in the distance. The light has changed, and day is turning to night. The sun is setting and you are feeling oh so tired. So heavy. So peaceful. You can see the stars coming out the sliver of a moon casts its gentle light onto the lawn. As you climb into bed, you feel so serene, so comfortable. Taking some nice deep breaths as your body meets the surface below. Allowing your physical body to settle. Settle into the surface below you. You release the day. You release the day and it feels almost almost like the putting down of a heavy bag. Release. And as I count down from ten to one, you will feel deeper and deeper relaxed. Ten, nine, down and down, deeper down, eight, all the way down to the sweet serenity of sleep. Feeling totally at ease. Six. The more you let go, the better you feel. Five. Four. Almost to the bottom now. Sinking down and down. Deeper down. Three. Allowing the gentle embrace of sleep to come to you now. Two and one. All the way down to that deeper, healthier level of the mind. Resting. Resting.